Hello all, in this video we will see how to install Arduino Core onto this uh, DigiSpark 8085, a compact uh, microcontroller. Due to the built-in USB connector, you can directly program the 8085 using Arduino IDE. It features 8KB of flash memory, 512 bytes of SRAM and E-square PROM and 6 I.O. pins. The 6 digital I.O. pins are multiplexed with 4 analog pins and also I2C and uh, SPA interface is also supported. On board there is 5 volt regulator so at V in you can supply 5 volt to 12 volt supply. You can plug in this board directly to the USB port of your PC. Open the uh, device manager. Now it says uh, the device is not recognized so you have to install a uh, driver. Uh, the driver uh, we are going to install is uh, this uh, digi spark driver previously digi stump was there but now we are going to install digi spark which is uh, supported for this 8085 the link is given in the description below download the uh, driver unzip it and then install the 64-bit uh, version as my PC is 64 bit. I am installing the 64 bit version of the driver. Once the driver is installed, if you open the device manager, the device has been recognized. Now let us open the Arduino IDE and then install the board, boards manager. Open the Arduino IDE, latest Arduino IDE under File Preferences, you have to include a link for this uh, Boards Manager. Let us uh, get the link from this uh, spin scone, that is uh, Dr. Aziz link, AT Tiny Core link. Under this AT Tiny Core installation, you can get the uh, Boards Manager link. The link is given in the description below. You can go to the link and get the uh, link for this uh, boards manager. Copy this and then paste it onto this. Uh, control C to copy and Control V to paste under this files preferences. Now go to the boards manager and then search for AT Tiny Core and then. Uh, install this AT Tiny Core by Spence Cone. Once this Boards Manager is installed, you get the uh, um, micro nucleus that is USB support. It is a V USB, a bit bang USB implementation to provide USB connectivity on ports which uh, do not have hardware USB support. Now the boards manager uh, under the board you can select AT Tiny Core and then AT Tiny Core Micro Nucleus Digi Spark. Select this board and then select the programmer as Micro Nucleus. This is very important. Programmer must be Micro Nucleus. Now the settings uh, are done. Now open the uh, uh, Blink sketch and then click upload. It will be directly uploaded. In the previous versions, you have to remove the board and then plug it back again. There is a wait time for the bootloader. Now it will upload directly. If you uh, plug in the USB board directly, you can directly upload it. You can see the code has been uploaded and the onboard LED blinks. Thank you for watching.